It's not just mine, his or her house. This is our house. Hello everyone, my name is Tyrone Lowe. This is my show, The Legends. And I want to thank everybody that subscribes to my show and show me love, you know? I really appreciate it. In the House of the Legends, I have two producers. Um, I've known for a while, you know, and um, pretty much got some good background. They're also producers, they got a new track out, and we're going to talk about all that. So in the House of the Legends, I give you Edgar Torres, Disco Day. What's going on, guys? What's going on? How you What's doing? Up? I'm all right, man. Good, uh, you know, good, um, good to come to the legends, you know, and yeah, stuff. Thank you. But Edgar, we're gonna we're gonna start with you because you're, I'm more familiar with your patent as far as your production, so we're gonna talk about, you know, we need to tell the viewers about some of that. So, how did you actually get started in the production field, musically? Wow. Um... It just basically started with the equipment. Once I got the equipment set up, it was like, let's go. <laughs> right. um, and now Disco Dave was on board. Um, he just helped out with even more equipment, just brought in a 32 track mixer, um, plus my mixer. And, and then we got the Allen Heath mixer. So we got a lot of equipment, a lot of sounds, and uh, we just rolling basically. Okay, that's, that's quiet, man. Disco Dave, what's going on, dude? I mean, uh, me and Edgar got started um, with Don Welch and right. Underground Network. Yeah, we went to I know Don stuff. very well, we yeah. Together. And we went on with that from there, and we just like, I said, yeah, Yo, you want to go to the studio? And we took him to the studio, and he had his studio, and with the studio that I was affiliated with, and... We just went on with that. We, we just vibe right away. Who does most of the production, though? I mean, well, productively. Well, I'm hands-on. so it's basically Okay, that's my, what I'm saying. My, yeah. yeah. So I do the hands-on work. Uh, Disco Dave is co-producer. So he'll, like, you know, listen to the tracks, and he'll say, you know, too much bass, or could you put some horns in there? Um, he's like that third He's eye, like He's you know? like that A&R guy. You know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this because Dave was the man. I mean, it's just that when I was DJing from back then, back in the seventies, eighties, you know, right. And my ear just took off from there, and I could hear good music when I know it's there. And like when I uh, was starting, I was playing a lot of Colonel Avon's records, right. you know, back then. Then when I put it in the closet. Then I come to find out I'm working with Colonel. Wow. You know, so I had to take all of his records back out <laughs> again. <laughs> and then we got together with Don Welch. And I was saying we was looking for some more people for a studio. And right. then Ada had a studio that, that makes it more, more my job more easier. You know, from there. And we buy from there because um, like you said, with my ears. And knowing the good music, and also I'm a dancer as well, and you know that just clicks. Okay, so Edgar, you know, um, when you premiere your your tracks at a club, you know, like let's say when Frankie Paradise is playing, and um, he submits these tracks while the crowd, you know, while the crowd is there and stuff like that, how does it make you feel when they react to your your production? Oh wow, it's it's amazing. I mean, when you hear your stuff, it's, you know, because now, you you know, you hear it in a club. So it's a totally different feeling when you hear that bass, that bass, yeah. <laughs> you know, and it's just booming and you see the crowd's reaction. Uh, there's times where uh, Disco Dave was able to get it uh, featured at Soul Summit. I wasn't there, but Disco Dave was telling me about it, it was a great response. So, um, you know, how I feel is cool but it's really about how the crowd feels and right, yeah. but you want to know something mm -hmm. when i took the track when edgar couldn't make it and 
the track was Drums of Peace. And when Drums of Peace got introduced to Soul Summit, it just took off right there. I mean, they was jumping. I was showing Edgar the video. They were jumping on top of speakers. I mean, everywhere. <laughs> and it was a good feeling because we didn't know how the song was going to be. Right. You but know, I've, 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 I've listened to it. Yeah. I've listened to you guys. Out. I've listened to you guys for a while. They was all over us. You know, I've listened to Edgar for a while, you know, uh, some tracks because Frankie used to give me some stuff. You know, I played for LWR and I would play him. You know what I'm saying? But right. uh, you got some, y'all got some nice stuff, man. <laughs> you got I some mean, nice stuff. I mean, really. Paradise put it down. That's yeah. it. So, I, you know, I want to give a, I want to give a shout out to my boy, Frankie Paradise, you know, and, um, you know, because I know y'all in collaboration, you know, and. Yes. And stuff like that. Yeah. I so, Edgar, wanna... what's going on, man? Let's say something, you know, talk about something that's actually, that you're in actually involved with now you know currently. oh wow a lot of stuff <laughs> it's just because i because I, i'm a graphic designer and i got a partner cleveland right the third who's a videographer um you got yourself man and it's like because you'd be dealing with elements is has to do with broadcasting everybody they come to you because you know showcase our stuff showcase this showcase that i'm connected with magazines broadcasting there's so much that comes in the helm of what we do in the, right, in the world right. of creativity. It's just like, you don't have to look for work. Work finds you. Sometimes you be ducking. It's like, no, no more work. Let me rest, please. <laughs> Let me rest. But it's all good. It's all good. We but appreciate it. But it was funny that he said that, how work finds you when you don't look for it, which is true. And it yeah. comes out of you like, like Atlantic Ocean. <laughs> It just come and don't stop. Big waves, big, big waves. waves. <laughs> I hear that. Know? It just don't that's stop. That's what's up, and that's really what's up, you know. Yes, yes, yes. I I have to. Also... Hey, how long you been producing though? How long you been producing? Wow, I go back. I graduated from Pratt Institute, and I was actually um, a radio host at Pratt Institute for uh, okay. W. Yeah, Pratt Institute Radio was W P I R Pratt Institute Radio. So okay. I was a, you know, had I was a radio host slash DJ at Pratt Institute. So um, from there, I just evolved, and I always wanted to have my own studio. Right. And then I was able to get my own studio, and it just kept growing. And it's, the studio is not just for music; it's also for graphic designs, for video editing, kind of like what you do. You multi, you know, multi-purpose, multi, and you gotta have, you know. You know, you can't put all your iron, iron to one fire, like they say, whatever. Right. right. Yeah. So um, it's all a blessing, you know. All first and foremost, well, you know, to, I, you know, I, 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 I actually feel this is something I was born to do. You know, um, mm. what, maybe one of my purposes. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Everybody yeah. has a purpose. You never know where you're yeah. gonna land, and yeah. if you land, you don't know if you're necessarily gonna like it. But what I have to tell you, you end up loving it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, it's, it's like I said, you know, it's a bit of blessing for us that we always being at the right place at the right time. Right, right. Along with the music, I ran into so many people that way, including people from WBLS and Kiss FM, how right. me and Barry Mason got together. Also, when Barry was at Kiss, I was helping him out over there at the station. And, right. You know, we all collaborate. In one way to meet up with each other again and just help each other out. Yeah, I also want to mention um, Zaylin. Zaylin played a very, very big right. role because he um, connected me to I Musician, which allows me to just go straight to the distributor. So now right. I'm I don't deal with the record label. I just go straight to the distributor. Right, right, right. And it's it's just better. I Musician is made by artists for artists. So I musician understands what it's like when you're an artist and you're struggling, you're trying to make it. Um, Cause like, basically at the end of the day, nothing personal, it's just business. That's, yeah, it. that's all it is. But you know, listen guys, um, we're going to listen to one of their tracks and um, go out there, support them, listen to them because I think their tracks are really nice. 
So stay tuned. We'll be right back. Thank you. Thank you. For the love of house, the dynamic the soul sound of for the love DJ of Tyrone Low. DJ Tyrone Low. Dynamic soul sounds of DJ Tyrone Low. And we're back. My name is Tyron Lowe. This is my show, The Legends. And in the house of the legends, I have Edgar Torres of Disco J. What's going on, guys? All right. Um, everything is going gravy. Um, we just now, listen, l- listen, let's talk about some futuristic things. What, what do you guys put your hands into right now 
And what do you do you feel is really going to be like at the level at where you're at right now? Uh, answer that. Yeah, sorry, we're sharing the headphones. <laughs> What's going on? No, I said I just want to know what you guys are getting your hands into right now, and to the point where it just stinks at the level that you guys are at right now, as far as production. Well, we got another track out uh, called "We Fly Away." That's gonna really take off. That's one I'm singing on. I'm not sure right. if you have that one, but um, that's gonna be a new one added into the collection. And uh, basically, um, I'm just basically riding the, like you say, it comes in waves. I'm just basically surfing right now on the wave because things just right. come at me, and I just handle everything accordingly, you know, to the to, to the best of my ability, you know. Um, hey, what other producers are you, are you listening to? Who do you who do you listen to? You know that's out there right uh, now uh i'm really a fan of uh dj jovan uh Javon. dj yeah dj Colin, of course dj frankie paradise um Zaylin has been a very uh, inspirational producer and artist um there's a lot out there and disco dave sends me um a lot of, of material to study he keeps me constantly studying <laughs> Check out this. What's, what's the other DJ? Oh, there's a lot of DJs. A whole I mean, like, lot of DJs. Louis Vega, Louis Joe Clarcel. Joe, Joe Clarcel. Yeah, he's my Louis. idol. So, <laughs> Timmy yeah. Regisford. You know, that's that's where I learned all of my uh, music from, dealing with those people. And it showed me a lot of love behind the scenes. And a lot of times when I be with them at the DJ booth and they let me watch. Mm -hmm. And I feel so thrilled and ready to go home and try to do it. You know, pretty soon, try to make a comeback coming soon. With is, I'm going to show the world like what we can do from what we had started from the 70s. Yeah, yeah. I just I just want to say, you know, before we close, um, we're happy. We, we, we got some time. We got some time. Yeah. Um, there's a bigger story about what happened with Disco Dave. He, um, he had a serious um, illness and he was in the hospital very close okay. to death. I came to the right. hospital and um, it, it like really like moved me to want to help him. When he was able to survive this, I was like, wow, because he was all wired up and, and he, it just a scary moment, you know, when you see someone. Right, you, right, right. See your boy in the hospital like that. And then after that, he had another situation where a fire came and, and just, just, just he lost all his stuff, all of his equipment. Oh man! So I basically I just kind of like been doing what I can to be to the rescue. That's very nice of you, man. You know, to care yes. like that. Yeah, a lot of people don't. A lot of people don't think like that. You know what I'm saying? All that happened, and so many people gave me love from BLS, Central Park, you know, and everything. Um, uh, Lenny Green, all of them gave me a lot of love, you know, support. Right. You know, and everything. I, I don't even know I had that much people that really love me like that. You know, <laughs> you know I was so man? surprised. You all love Disco Dave. You know what I mean? Because like, you got that type of thing. It was like so you. packed up in there. And I, I didn't even know who was there. Right. You know, to be honest. And and I would say, wow, they, they told me they stopped the music in Central Park to say a prayer for me. That's you love, know? man. That's and it love. goes to show you how much. You yeah. know that people is really into you right when you yeah. are doing something positive yeah and man. you helped out a lot of people and i helped out a lot of people as well when they needed help i was there and dave, you, you, yeah like dave what, what you got for the dave, can you hear me? could dave hear me no i don't think it, no hold on let me switch okay you can hear me now dave yeah i can hear you now okay listen uh, what what you got what you got for the future man what 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 do you what what kind of picture are you painting right okay now? now for the future what i'm working on now is is rebuilding the studio back up also my sound system plan on coming back me and my crew is back together now okay you know with the uh CeeLo sounds and the city sounds we all got together we're trying to get things started it's you know situated for the summer and beyond and Edgar's going to be there as well and slamming track. There's a whole bunch of us 
And when we get ready to look for the future ahead, we're working on some anniversary party. We're trying to get together from that we did when we was in the 70s, trying to bring that back a little bit. Okay. And I will be playing coming soon. Uh, yeah, I, I want you to come back, man. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. 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 I will be playing. Um, we're just working on some things. I just got the call in today. Right. Uh, so they're working on my new sound system and uh, trying to get it here to New York. And we're going to go with that from there. Once that gets here, I will be back. Y'all already y'all already landed, man. Yeah, we, <laughs> really. We already, I mean, you're, I you're mean, already here. I don't yeah. listen, man. I, I can't see how you how you're saying that as far as going to be when you're already right. already here. You know, I, listen, I used to I mean, tell listen, people. I've listened to some of the stuff that um that Frankie's given me for a while. Yo, man, right. fantastic, fantastic. Wow. I'm really. I mean, so fantastic cool. tracks, man. You know. I mean, I mean, if y'all can see my eyes now, I have invisible tears just coming out. Hey, man, it's like you know. <laughs> come on, man. I don't you know, think, I mean, uh, yo, know, the sound, the sound that you guys put out, it's like, it's it's just nice arrangement. Let me tell you, we got a. And it doesn't just go into one pattern; it right. goes into like. You know, a different type of mood and stuff. Uh -huh. it's, it's it's hot. It's really we got hot. a we got a call from Jovan. Okay. And he called me. The first thing Jovan said, "Congratulations." Like I said, you guys have landed. He said, "Y'all is rocking." Yeah, man, for real. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's what he told me. He said, "Yo, you keep doing. You're hot. Stay hot." What? What? Um, let me ask you a question. Um. Um. I'll give the um give the headphones back to Edgar. Okay. So. Hello. So Edgar, um, how how are you distributing your music, man? You know, I mean, what's what's going on as far as distributing and what DJs are really playing your stuff right now that you've given to? Well, once again, like I mentioned, we got thanks to Zaylin, uh, we got iMusician which is a distribution platform. So it gets us on track source. The main thing was to get on track source. Right, so right. We got, we're on track source and then we're on like, it's like 200, I don't even know all the stores, but it's like basically 200 like stores two, worldwide. Over 200. Huh? Over 200 stores. Yeah, uh, our musician is, lo is, just, is the distrib distributor to about 200 stores. So it's Apple, it's uh, Tidal, um, uh, all the Spotify, all, all the major ones and stuff I never even heard of before. I hear that. World, worldwide. So, um, and then DJs, you know, DJs, if they can contact me, whatever, maybe they can contact you. I, I, I'll give it to the DJs for free. You know, well, you know before you leave, you know, just tell them how they can contact you guys right quick. You know, give them a number, give them an email address so they can get in contact with you guys and, you know, enhance your um, production, man, you know? Right. For me... It's Edgar Torres Creative. You got to Google Edgar Torres Creative or Edgar Torres Music. So either Edgar Torres Creative or Edgar Torres Music on Google, you will find me. And just remember that get the one with my face, not the other Edgar Torres, because there are other Edgar Torreses out there. And then that's how you connect with me. Um, and we're also on Bandcamp and uh, Disco Dave is on our Bandcamp platform and a lot of the other platforms as well. I hear you. Well, listen, guys, it's been an honor to have both of y'all on my show, man. And, you know, come again. You know what I'm saying? And um, before we leave, you're going to hear something else that they've done. And I, I think they really did a phenomenal job on this because their, their production is a little bit different, but it's hot. Okay. So stay tuned for another T Love Video production. And um, y'all have a nice day. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we fly away. We fly away. We 
To worry, rhythm in the hurry, set your mind free, take me where I wanna be.